What is happening? Welcome to episode number 248. Is that right? Gosh, it's so insane. It is Monday, January the 2nd, and I am heading out to show a house. Uh, it's not morning. It is like 12.45 in the afternoon. To tell on myself a little bit, I slept nine hours last night, which was beautiful. Over the past like four days prior to that, I've been averaging about four and a half hours of sleep, which isn't bad for like one night, but when you start stringing those suckers together, like it sucks something fierce. I weighed myself today, and every time I start a diet, I can cut serious weight in one day. To be fair, yesterday I weighed at like 7.30 in the morning, and today I weighed at like noon 30. So that's one thing to factor in, but I weighed in at 270.4 pounds. Five pounds since yesterday, which is pretty cool. Let's dig in and get it done. Yeah. Alright, I got my showing taken care of and it's time for lunch. Here's my keto healthy-ish lunch thing. Iceberg lettuce, organic, which I care less about. Toasted sesame chopped salad. It's kind of a cabbagey thing. Some pita chicken, three slices of bacon, some pecans and God's gift to salad dressing. So, it should be a pretty healthy lunch. I go fly the drone, the racing drone, but uh, in the meantime, I wanted to set up a bit of a bag for all my stuff, because yesterday I almost forgot my uh, one little battery container, so. Um, I'd like to get a more traditional backpack, but this is what I got. I ain't gonna spin it. I'm out here at Howard Hills, the athletic complex, and I'm gonna fly the racing drone around. I've been working on the simulator with doing a maneuver called a split S. Well, I definitely want to give that a shot today. Let's do it. Note to self, Sean. So I crashed the drone, but it landed right side up. Instead of going, getting up and checking on it, I just took off again. Apparently I took off without the GoPro. So that was a pretty bad idea because when I came down the next time, I went to the drone and there was no GoPro on it. So I had to like try to remember where it had fallen off. I'm gonna get up there again. Let's do some more flying. <laughs> Successful flights today. Christy has made spaghetti squash tonight. Like some sort of faux spaghetti thing. I'll be completely honest, I'm not the most excited about it. Me either. It looks like some good meat sauce. Meat sauce? How many carbs we got in that stuff? So she shredded out the inside of this squash. You're supposed to put it on your plate and pretend it's spaghetti. Christy made me a plate. Like, I feel fine having not drank a Diet Pepsi. I mean, I have a mild headache, but the big thing is like just, I feel like it changes the way everything tastes. I believe that all taste is acquired, and so it's just a matter of relearning what's good. I have to tell my brain that unsweet tea is good. Bread tastes gross. Vegetables pretending to be spaghetti are good. It looks good, look at that. What do you guys think? Did you guys pray already? It's actually 
actually really good. Very, very yummy. Good job, Christy. Cheese makes everything better. dinner. Um, I'm actually working on downloading the DRL Drone Racing League sim Simulator on Christy's computer so I can play with the girls. Callie just went to basketball practice but beforehand I was working with her on the drone simulator and then right now Maddie's working on it. So. <laughs> Maddie, did you have fun playing drone simulator? Good deal. Well, guys, I think we're going to wrap it up for tonight. Thank you to everyone who's been sharing the episodes on Facebook. Really appreciate that. It means the world to us, guys. Remember to hit that big old thumbs up if you think we deserve it. Share again, subscribe, and we will absolutely see you tomorrow on... Life in the Wild. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> All right, guys. Thanks for checking out the end card and hanging around for this long. How to find us if you have questions about real estate below. Um, remember, we are real estate agents. If you need help buying or selling, I'm just going to say anywhere in Missouri, give us a call. We would love to help you. If you're in a different area, different state, wherever you are, if you're thinking about buying or selling and you don't know what real estate agent you'd like to use, we've got this amazing service. Go ahead and send us an email at the address below. And what we can do is we can connect you with the best agent in your area. We understand this business. I know you guys think we're in the vlogging business, but we are absolutely in the real estate business. We sell gobs of houses. We helped 102 different people sell and buy houses last year, and we would love to get you on the road to owning your own home. So be sure and click that. Remember, if you've made it this far, right up here to your right, you click there if you want to see yesterday's episode. Uh, right down here, you can click if you want to subscribe. You should definitely do that. And that's it, guys. We absolutely look forward to seeing you tomorrow on Life in the